Welcome to this presentation from the Wisconsin First Detector Network. This video was adapted from a Wisconsin First Detector Network training session. In this video, you'll hear Brian Huddleston from the Plant Disease Diagnostic Clinic talk about impatience downy mildew. Impatience downy mildew has been a disease that's been really an issue for greenhouse growers, but interestingly, this is also a pathogen on our native impatience. So things like jewel weeds can potentially get this disease. And that actually may be a reservoir for this organism because we have been seeing it constantly. It was kind of introduced, reintroduced into the state. It's probably been around, but it became a big issue about four years ago when there was a greenhouse that was producing to standard impatience that had a, a problem with the pathogen, didn't realize it, and then shipped plants out uh, throughout most of North America. And so we had a real horrible time with it, it will actually kill garden impatience. But again, just to keep in mind, what you look for is this kind of white fuzzy material on the undersurface of the leaf that's sporulation of the organism. And again, you may see this if you're out and about where there's jewelry, you can uh, potentially see this on that particular plant as well. And again, we have reports of this organism in the state. The first formal report is in 1948, but historical descriptions of what was probably this disease way back in the 1880s. So again, there is this synergy between native species and some of our important ornamentals. We're feeding pathogens back and forth. The pathogens oftentimes don't care uh, whether it's a native or a, what we consider an ornamental. And this is how you get a hold of me if you have any questions. Thanks for watching this video from the Wisconsin First Detector Network. To learn more about our network or to access additional information about invasive species in Wisconsin, please visit our website or contact us.